I want to preface this video by saying Etika was the biggest Nintendo hype beast to ever live. Let that sink in. Etika was the biggest Nintendo hype beast to ever live, and Nintendo is silencing his message. I wasn't originally planning on making a video about this, and I probably won't address it anymore in the future because my channel is about me playing Nintendo games, having a good time, making some funny memes, and I want it to be positive, I genuinely do, but this is something that um, really meant a lot to me and really hit deep. When Etika passed, I was in the middle of doing a Christian literature evangelism program, and I remember every evening after work, I would look on Twitter, look online, and just try to find updates about the Etika situation, because I was, I was genuinely worried about him. Um, and when I found out that they found his body, I was devastated by it. After that, in Etika's honor, a guy by the name of Captain Alex, as I'm learning, made a product called Eticons in support of Etika, which were basically custom Joy-Cons originally purchased from Nintendo and then made in a certain style to honor the memory of Etika. And this was not for profit. Don't get that stuck in your head at all that this was ever for any sort of profit. This was going directly to charity to help support mental health awareness as well as suicide prevention. All of this was in good spirit, and recently Nintendo ordered that the production of the Eticons just be completely stopped. I, I get it, it's within their legal right to do something like that. I'm not talking legality right now, I'm talking about ethics. What ethical reason did Nintendo have for stopping the production of Eticons? All it was doing was honoring one of Nintendo's biggest hype beasts and supporters for their Joy-Cons, while at the same time raising money to help prevent what happened to Etika happening to anyone else. No one should have to feel alone in their mental illness or their suicidal thoughts. People should be able to have the support they need, and that's exactly what Captain Alex was trying to do with this product. I don't understand Nintendo. I want to love Nintendo. I want to support their products. That's what this channel's about. I've loved their games. I still love their games. I'm not going to stop posting on this channel, obviously, because I'm having a good time playing their games. But goodness gracious, Nintendo, why? Why do you have to disappoint your fans? You know, it was one thing to just cancel some tournaments because they weren't using your products. Um, those are tournaments. I get that. This is charity, and this is honoring one of your fans. If you can't see that, I don't see much hope for you being able to connect with your fans in the future. I'm sorry if I'm a little emotionally charged right now. Um, I felt like I had something to say, and I wanted to say it. I know a lot of people have probably already shared their thoughts and gone into all the little details and caveats of the situation. So I hope this video raises awareness, and it was something that was really important to me. I'm not going to touch on this issue again just because I don't want to spread further negativity. Unless, of course, Nintendo does something absolutely horrendous, but I would prefer it if I don't make any more of these videos and I make more of the fun content that you guys enjoy me making. One last thing I want to say before I end this video is I'm going to put a link in the description to the charity that Captain Alex was trying to support, and if at all possible, please donate to that charity because they're not getting any donations from the Eticons anymore, which is sad. Also, another thing, if you have Twitter, Instagram, literally any social media, TikTok, spread the hashtags Free Melee, Free Splatoon, Save Smash, and Joy-Con Boys Forever. And spread some of those hashtags, spread awareness, let Nintendo know what you think. I can't say if they'll respond, but it's the least we can do to help get our voices heard in this situation. Thanks for understanding, guys. We're going to have a really great video next week. You guys are going to love it. It's about a game that I just tried out for the first time, and I had a really good blast with some friends. It's going to be a collab. Hey, yeah. Anyways, I'll put the link in the description. Thank you, guys. And I'm excited for where this channel takes us. And as always, remember, when life gives you coins, make one-ups. Bye.